Welcome to this Windows Server 25 Basics video. In these videos, I will go over basic concepts related to the administration of Windows Server. In this video, we're going to talk about raising the domain and forest functional level to Windows Server 2025. Windows Server 25 represents the first time a new domain, and forest functional level has been included since Windows Server 2016. The Windows Server 25 domain and forest functional level includes the following improvements. New domain controllers can be installed with a 32K page database using 64-bit long value IDs, Kerberos authentication improvements, with support for advanced encryption, SHA-256 and 384 cryptography, improved LDAP security, replication enhancements, object repair technologies, and hardened default computer account passwords. To raise the domain functional level to Windows Server 2025, ensure that all domain controllers in the domain are running Windows Server 2025, and that there are no domain controllers running any earlier version of Windows Server. Then open the Active Directory Users and Computers console, right-click on the domain, and then select Raise Domain Functional Level. Once you raise the domain functional level, the domain will only support domain controllers running Windows Server 25 or later. Once the domain functional level of all domains in a forest is raised to Windows Server 2025, you can then raise the forest functional level to Windows Server 2025. Once the forest level is raised, you won't be able to add new domains running at the Windows Server 2016 or lower functional level to the forest. To raise the forest functional level, open the Active Directory Domains and Trusts console, right click on the top level node and select Raise Forest Functional Level. And that's how you raise the Active Directory Domain and Forest Functional Level to Windows Server 2025. 